Hello everyone, my name is Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I have an Ace Magic computer. I'm gonna show you how you can install Windows 11 onto it. Now to start with, I'm using an install media USB that I created for myself for free. If you would like help on doing that, there'll be a video link above. Also below in the description, it'll show you how you can create that for yourself for free using another computer. If that's not an option for you and you need to purchase that USB, there'll be a link below in the description. It'll be a list of a lot of the tools and supplies that I use in my computer shop. And I'll have an option in there for a Windows 11 install media USB. So to start, shut your computer down, make sure it's off, make sure it's plugged into your charger. You want it plugged in during this process. Also, if you have any questions, check out the frequently asked questions below in the description. It could save you some time getting an answer. I do try to keep those updated. And if you need to leave me a question or comment, I do try to answer them at least a couple times a day. Okay, so I'm gonna hit my power button to start it and immediately start tapping on the delete key. I'm then gonna take my Windows 11 install media USB, plug it into the USB port, and then I'm gonna use my arrow keys to move over to the boot option. And as you see here, my boot order, number one is the hard disk or the hard drive. I want it to boot from the USB. So I'm gonna come down here, I'm gonna hit enter on my USB, and then I'm gonna go up to my hard disk and hit enter. And that way, as you see here, I've just switched. I've taken my USB and I've put it to boot option one. So now when the computer boots, it'll go for my Windows 11 install media USB. So then down here, F10, save and reset. I'm gonna hit F10. Save configurations and reset, yes. Now the computer's gonna reboot and hopefully go for that USB to boot off of instead of the hard drive. So this is your first install screen. I will take you through the options here and show you where to go. Also, many of you like me, you're not gonna have access to your mouse, your trackpad. So I'm gonna go get a plug-in USB mouse so I can use that right now. Okay, so now that I have my mouse, I'm gonna select next and then I'm gonna choose install now. So now I'm gonna select yes for English. I'm gonna select yes for US. And your options may be different depending on, on where you are. I'm just taking you through so you know what options to expect. I'm gonna hit yes again. I uh, wanna add a second keyboard layout. I'm gonna skip this. Uh, TNCs, I'll accept them. Who's gonna use this device? I'm just gonna name it Ace Magic. I'm gonna skip the password part. I'm not gonna put a password again because this is for resale. Uh, you guys can do what you want. I'm gonna hit next to skip that. Uh, I'm gonna turn all these off. Uh, I generally don't like giving people my data for free. Um, so I'll turn all these off. You, you can do what you want, but that's just something that I do as a habit. I'll accept that, and now it'll finish up. And there we are, back at our desktop. So that's the video, that's how you install Windows 11 onto an Ace Magic. Keep in mind that this is a fresh version of Windows 11, there may be a lot of updates you need to run. I will have a video link above, also below in the description, how you can manually make sure all your updates are run all at once. You don't have to do that, but if you don't run them all at once right now, then they'll be installing themselves automatically in the background, maybe for days, could be even weeks, depending on how long you use your computer, and it could just slow things down. I've always found it's best to get them all done right away. Again, if you have any questions, check out the FAQs below. I do try to keep those updated. If you need to leave me a question or comment, please feel free to. I get to those at least a couple times a day. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I look forward to seeing you on my next video.